How you doing? I don't want to brag, but I picked up a couple of bargains last week. Didn't have to go anywhere near the mall. Got them the old-fashioned way. Went to an auction. Try and find yourself one of these at the sharper image. If you're going to go to an auction around these parts, you got to work on your nod. You know, a lot of folks think you got to wave or wave your little paddle, but you just got to give them the nod. Just to... my buddy Mills goes to a lot of a lot of auctions, and he says about a 12 degree tilt is about right. Just go. That's a bid right there. Saw these babies on the hay wagon. This was the first object that I bought. Uh, these are logging tongs. These are for hauling your. Uh, your log out of the woods and uh, boy you know I started bidding on it and I realized once the bidding started I really didn't know how much one was worth so I just kept bidding and uh, I think I got it for about 30 bucks of course as soon as I won it I walked away carrying it proudly and this guy comes up to me and goes what'd you pay for that and I looked him right in the eye and I said twenty dollars because when someone asks you what you pay for something at an auction you lie to them let me tell them how much I paid because if you tell him how much he paid, sure enough, he goes, Oh, cripes, you can get those for $18 brand new down to the farm and fleet. I don't want to know that. Don't tell me that. That's not helpful. Then I was, uh, they had one of them deals where they just kind of, they hold up a bunch of junk and you bid on them. And I've been looking for a corn knife. And I saw a corn knife in this mess of stuff here and they held it up. Two bucks for this whole assortment. And I want to tell you something, I scored. This right here is an aluminum case for uh, putting notebooks in and kind of like what, what we use on the ambulance. And I always wanted one around the, around the farm here uh, to put my notebooks in because um, I'm not sure why, but I always wanted to have my own. And I had my eye on these here on a big pile of stuff on a hay wagon and I wandered off somewhere and when I came back they'd already sold that pile. And I was, I was looking at the pile and the guy who bought it he looked at me and he saw my long face and he said, did you have your eye on something in there? And I said, yeah, I was kind of looking at them, them aluminum folders there. And, and he said, well, what do you give me for them? I said, I'll give you two bucks. And he said, all right. He paid five bucks for the whole pile and I paid two bucks for these aluminum folders. But he said, you got to take the computer. So I got a computer. The other thing I wanted was a Matic and they had one there. and. Uh, Matic is a pickaxe. It's got a flat blade on one end. And uh, several of the old timers said, you know how to run that thing, son? And my standard joke of the day was, well, I keep looking. I can't find the starter on it. And I said that joke about four or five times, got a nice laugh. And about the sixth time, I met somebody funnier than me. And I said, well, I can't find the starter on this thing. And he looked at me and he said, she's at home. It was cold and rainy at the auction that day. Perfect weather because the farmers couldn't get into the field. So they all came to the sale. They had a great turnout. But the mood sort of matched the weather. I've been having a good time talking about auctions here, and I, I like going to the auction. I like bidding for stuff. I like giving the old nod. But the truth was, we were participating in the end of the line for a long time hometown family business. This was the place where my dad bought his first tractor. I'll try to keep that in mind when I use that corn knife.